fuck, it's snowing today. Wow. Hey everyone, it's Twain's Tiger Dude here. As you can see, it is really snowy. It's rare for there to be snow. Uh, welcome to my DVD Blu-ray update. Um, there's no way I'm gonna do one outside, so let me go inside and get comfy. Eclipse! Eclipse! Eclipse, get your ass back inside, dog. Get your ass back inside. Yeah, yeah. There you go. By the way, this is also my first DVD video game update of 2015. I bought these movies from Target. I bought the video game from Entertain Mart. So without further ado, let's get my first update of the year 2015 started. So the first movie I bought is The Expendables 3. Now, I'm going to be honest, in my opinion, I had a lot of fun with The Expendables 3. I don't care if it's PG-13. I really don't care if it's rated R like the first two movies are. You know, all I care about when I go into an action movie is if it's good. I wanted a fun movie, and that's exactly what I got when I saw it in theaters. That's why I own it, because I had so much fun with this movie. It's okay if you guys didn't like it. I can understand the disappointment behind it, but I had a lot of fun with this movie. And I was going to buy this on Black Friday originally, but the deal for this one wasn't really good. Very fun action. Good to see the stars. I didn't mind at least two out of four of the youngsters, in my opinion. Like the storyline. There might be a possibility for a fourth one, but honestly, if this is the last movie in the franchise, I really wouldn't complain. The Expendables 3, it's a blast. I really enjoyed it, and that's why I own it. $10 at Target. Now, the next movie I also got for $10 from Target is... Draft Day. Draft Day was such a fun and great movie. It was a different movie for the genre of football movies. You know, this is not a football movie where someone is out on the field playing. No, this is drafting for football. And I like that this is a little different from the genre. It felt refreshing just to watch a movie that dealt with drafting. Now, I know this wasn't everyone's cup of tea. If you're a huge football fan, then you can enjoy this. But if you're not into sports, then I can see how this movie would bore people. Now, I wouldn't say I'm the biggest football fan, as I stated in my review for this. I do watch it, though, because my family is real big on it. Just sit there, watch football, and just kind of... Have fun watching it, really. All the actors are great here. Diggle from Arrow was in this. Tom Welling from Smallville. Although his role is very brief, he doesn't. you don't get much of him, unfortunately. But he was good here. Everyone was really good here. The writing was very clever. There's actually plenty of humor in this movie that made me laugh my ass off. I really, really had a great time with drafting. And now for a movie I bought for $5. And that is... Moneyball. I haven't seen this movie since 2011, but I thought Moneyball was a great movie. Brad Pitt gives possibly one of the best performances of his career. It was a movie that definitely hit me, and it's a movie I've been wanting to rewatch ever since. If I had to rate this, it would be three and a half out of four stars. I think it's a really, really good movie, and I look forward to rewatching Moneyball. And it was only five dollars at Target, so I just bought it because. It's a damn great movie. And now for the only video game that I bought for this update, and it's at Entertain Mart, and that is The Sly Collection. Only for $22.99. I have the fourth Sly, and now I have the first three movies into this one collection, which is so awesome. I played these first three games growing up. I loved and adored them so much. The games really kept stepping up in their game as time was going by in terms of like graphics and the storyline. The characters are great. They all have amazing personalities. It has some of the best graphics I've seen in a video game, period. The gameplay play is so fun. I love the adventures that these video games bring me. I am looking forward to the fifth game. I still don't know when that's coming out, but the fifth game, whenever it does come out, you know I'm going to be playing that game for sure. It's just so awesome. I can't stress enough how much I love this franchise. I grew up with it. I'm going to be replaying these three games over again, just like what I did with the fourth one a couple of more times. I mean, that's how much I love this franchise. It makes me want to go back and play them again and again and again. Slide one, slide two, and slide three, all into one.
So you guys, in the comments down below, let me know what did you think of Draft Day, Moneyball, The Expendables 3, and the Sly Collection. Now the snow is really starting to clear up. Like, holy shit. Is it just cold outside and holding the snowball? Oh, it's so cold. So thanks for watching, everyone. This is 22 Tiger Dude. And don't forget that I will always have Tiger Power. Rawr!